Yo guys, what's up? My name is Kilo and welcome back to this week's video. So today guys, I want to do a topic that is really common among the CSGO community and there's a lot of speculation about it. So for personal preference, for those that are just getting into CSGO and want some badass M4A1S skins, I decided to dedicate this for you because the M4A1S um, after, the, after it was nerfed was horrible and no one used it and now that people are starting to get used to it, they're starting to use it more so the prices are starting to go up and skyrocket again so if i were you i would get these skins while they're on the down low so without further ado let's get into this week's video which is my top in for anyone s skins under five bucks starting with number five all right guys so at number five spot we have the m4m1s basketball so this is a um really unique and awesome looking skin <clears throat> it has a metallic silver that reminds me of the material iron so it kind of looks like it was carved out of iron and it's car it's engraved a Chinese looking dragon I like to say or just a dragon and it really looks good and uh, the one thing that I really like about the skin that no other skins have it actually has a different muzzle on the top so if I take this off if you guys can see right there it has a bunch of holes in the muzzle and uh, no other CSGO skin or that I know of has a custom muzzle so that is really cool and uh, that, yeah, I just like it a lot. So this comes in factory new at two dollars and sixty-four cents. You can find it on the Steam Market, or you guys can try your luck at trying to get it in the Operation Vanguard case, which is um, really there's no use if you guys just want to get this. I just get it on the market. It's almost as much as a key, and it's a d guaranteed skin. So uh, yeah, that's why I made it to number five. Let's get on to number four. Alrighty guys, at the number 4 spot we have the M4A1S Atomic Alloy Field Tested. So this is actually a Stat Track Factory new, which are, I'm pretty sure there aren't a whole lot of these on the market. Mm, but I couldn't find the Field Tested one, and the Field Tested one comes in at $2.67. So they're about, about the same price of any key for any case. There might be some keys that are about $2.70, but it comes in about the same price as the key to open a case. So this is a very clean looking skin very similar to the nitro in some aspects as in the barrel and the buttstock extension however you want it guys but call it it has that same metallic orange and um, other than that it's just flat black with some on the upper receiver and the carrying handle it's all black the sights or the sights are actually orange and uh, it's a pretty incredible looking skin and a very cheap skin for field tested Field tested looks a little bit like this, but a little more wear, and actually, it's honestly worth the money in my opinion. You know, even if it is field tested, it's a pink, and it's one of the cheapest ones you can find. So that's why I made it on the number four. Let's get on to number three. All right, guys. So the number three spots we have the M4M1S Brightwater. So I actually owned this skin a while back when it when the prices were up. So this skin comes in at minimum wear is three dollars and eighteen cents. So it's a pretty cheap skin. Very nice looking one. The factory new one, unfortunately, has yet to be unboxed. But they do have the stat track versions, which go for around the minimum wear is about 15 bucks. This is very well worth its skin. It's a kind of a uh, unique color scheme. It basically looks like the camo palette that they put on army clothes, or they used to back in the day. But instead of black, brown, and dark green, it is white or not white actually. It's like a light gray dark blue and blue so it's a very nice looking skin with some black in it and it's actually worth the price this is found in the operation bravo case and comes in at three dollars and 18 cents so it's a little bit more than a key but in my opinion is well worth it for number three so let's get on to number two all right guys so at number two we have the m41s dark water coming in at four dollars and 32 cents for the minimum wear version it is found in the CSGO weapon case, the very first one, or the very first weapon case I think they ever released. Um, very simple and nice looking design. It look it basically, what it looks like to me is, um, if you guys don't know how hydro dipping is, that's what they do with a lot of custom guns in real life that they want to get these sick looking patterns on. And I'm not too sure what the process is, but the basis of it is, I'm pretty sure it's like a special mixture of paint that they put in uh, a, a solution. And um, then they get whatever they want to dip in, and they just dip that bitch in and mix it around, and it comes out with these unique and different every time looking camos. So this is a very nice one, just gray and black. Looks kind of like a zebra, but without the white 
<laughs> if that makes any sense. But it all in all is a very good skin for the price, which is four dollars and thirty four cents. Thirty four cents. So let's move on to my number one spot. All right, guys. So at the number one spot, we have the m 4 one s Guardian, which comes in at the field tested at exactly five dollars. So this is a very nice looking skin, very simple. And the reason I chose this is honestly, the order that I put it in is not my favorite order, but from cheapest to most expensive skin. And this comes in right at our budget at $5. And in my opinion, is it worth five bucks? Yes and no. Would I spend all my money if I had five bucks on Steam on one skin like this? I would say no. I would spend it on at least five, maybe three or five of your favorite weapons and if this really if you really love the skin go ahead and buy it but a really simple skin just a dark metallic blue on the upper and lower receiver and on the buttstock and it kind of looks like it has some sp like black sprinkles or sparkles or whatever you guys want to call it on it and then it has of course the CT logo on the magazine when you inspect it and it has the markings of a real 41s. So this is a you know, pretty good skin altogether, and I'm not sure where it's found actually. In what case, I totally forgot about that. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this top five list. If you guys have any other videos you would like to see me do, CS:GO wise or any other video, honestly, indie game, horror game, whatever you guys, leave it in the comment section below. If you guys want to see more of these videos, just hit two likes. And if you guys want to see another one like this, make sure to leave how much your budget is, or how much the budget it is, and how much money, or how much money the budget is, and what skin you want me to do, or, or what gun, for instance, an AK-47, which uh, I'll probably do in the future regardless, because that's one of the most popular guns along with the M4A1S and the M4A4. So I hope you guys enjoyed. My name is Kilo. Make sure to smack that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.